Good morning, welcome back to BTHQ banter number 21. We are officially halfway through the year. I actually cannot believe that I have been weekly vlogging for an entire six months. Very exciting for me anyway. Um, I hope you're enjoying it. Do let me know, do you want BTHQ banter to continue? Is it good? Do you love it? Um, I've just got in, it is Friday, it is just gone nine. Um, the kettle is on and I'm just waiting for the lovely Charlotte to arrive so we can start our jeans class. I'm very excited, as you can tell. I'm actually wearing handmade today as well. This is my black kilo wrap dress, although you probably can't see it. I'm gonna try and get some pictures for Instagram later um, with Charlotte for me made of my own if I manage to. I'm leaving a space here so that I can uh, pop them up and you can see them. Uh, so yeah, I'm sure there will be lots of footage from today and the next two days. Enjoy. Just opened the post. The irony, <laughs> we've just been sent some leaflets um, by Love Productions um, to encourage people to apply for the sewing bee. Um, we've also just received a poster which I've put on the fridge. So we've got the lovely Charlotte coming today, just as these arrive. I wonder if she'll apply. Clearly I can't count, can I? 21's not half of 52, is it? We're not six months through the year, but we're 21 weeks in, that's pretty good going. Anyway, Charlotte's here. Oh, and here comes Marie. That was good timing. Hey, Marie. <laughs> and here's Charlotte, Instagramming. And Eileen's here. And Susie's over there. And we're just waiting for Eileen. Yes. Yay. All right, onto paper. Yeah. <laughs> Stop laughing at me. <laughs> She's laughing at you. I'm not laughing at you. Um, and when you Marie do just that, looks confused. Yeah, yeah, sure. <laughs> get all the little notches. straight in with a full butt adjustment. <laughs> Born with it. <laughs> Apparently I've got a large bottom so we've got to do a butt adjustment. A large butt adjustment and Charlotte's just getting a, a bit of paper butt adjusts. so that we can do a butt insertion. <laughs> that sounds even more painful. Oh, hello. I'm a large butt adjustment. <laughs> Eat me. No, don't eat me, please. Nom, 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 nom. So I have finished my twirl and Charlotte has just fitted me. Now I did need a butt adjustment, as you saw, but Charlotte just went, mmm, assessed my bum, cut a bit in the pattern, went, that much ado. And even she's chuffed to say she's got a perfect fit by I've that much ado. How is that possible? Yeah. Obviously, so Charlotte, what were you saying? That I'm literally the first time you've ever... Not had to do a crotch adjustment. And that I'm pointless. You are completely pointless. I don't, I sh um, no, uh, there's no point in me because no. these trousers just fit me straight up. No. Why am I here, frankly? <laughs> <laughs> to fit everybody else who doesn't oh, have yeah. a massive bottom. <laughs> But the great yeah. thing is, it does mean that I can unpick these now. I've got to change the waistband ever so slightly, but it does mean that I'm doing a pink twirl. But I can actually use my pink, yay, to make my proper ones tomorrow, so I'm dead chuffed. Susan's got a sad crotch. <laughs> <laughs> Stop you laughing know, it's at funny. me. <laughs> I made these for my daughter. And she's got a round pubis. So I told her in front of her sister that, you know, she's got a prominent pubis. And now every time she walks in the room, I sit together, oh, you just got me in the eye with your pubis. <laughs> We have had an amazing first day, so many giggles, so much fun. Um, I should have just left the camera on all day really because you've missed some absolute corkers. Um, but yeah, we've had a lovely time. Everybody's gone home, it's just gone five. Um, everyone's gone back, most people have gone back to their hotels or back home just to chill out. And uh, I'm gonna go home and pour myself a nice June tree. Uh, I've cut all of mine out, I've been really fortunate that because my twirl fitted really quite well, um, I just managed to unpick it and cut out all the extra pieces I needed, which means that I can actually make a pink pair of jeans, which I'm really excited about. So I will still make a black pair of jeans, um, but I thought I'll make the pink ones first of all, which is excellent. Everyone else is just making a start on their cutting out, um, so we will get started stitching everything up tomorrow. 
I have decided though to use the last of my Arizona cactus fabric for my lining and this is my main trousers and Marie has very kindly swapped zips with me so I've got a pink zip as well um, so I'm going to have some rather funky jeans. You can see everybody's left all of their stuff ready to cut out tomorrow morning some of the ladies have started to draw their patterns on um, to the fabric and uh, yeah I'm looking forward to tomorrow it should be a lot of fun good morning it is Saturday it's 10 o'clock everybody's back in the studio and we're just setting our machines up so that we can do our stitching of our actual pair which is quite exciting the nice thing about this is that i've bought a couple of machines in from home so it means everybody's got two machines which means one they can use for their regular sewing and the other one they can use for their top stitching which means we haven't got to keep changing threads and changing needles which should save us some time and cut the pressure just a little bit so charlotte's just going around at the moment making sure everybody's all set up um, and that their feet are all in the right place and we're all doing what we should be doing and we'll be good to sew. Charlotte's got something in her pocket. What have yeah, you got in your pocket? All the unpickers. Literally all the unpickers. I don't Why? think there are any other unpickers in Why the world. Why have you stolen our unpickers? Because you're not allowed to unpick your top stitching. You are a mean I mean, woman. except for the bit on your crotch. That's the only bit I'll let you unpick. <laughs> but no, because otherwise it becomes an obsession. I'm just waiting for a mwah ha 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 Spot a top stitching practice. I'm quite happy with that. It's lunchtime. I need someone to guard the unpickers. Oh, ye. See, Viv, you come in really useful. <laughs> What's it worth for me to have an unpicker while Charlotte's out getting her lunch? Ten of an unpicker. That's not bad, actually. Yeah, I'd pay that. that. <laughs> they are actually starting to look like jeans. Look. Check out that top stitching. And we've got Leslie and Viv in the lounge. Let me zoom in on you ladies. Just zoomy, zoomy, zoom. Hello. I finished, what do you reckon? I've had to come outside for some fresh air. I want to apologize to all of my beginner sewers who I have ever taught to insert a zip into a cushion for using the words it's really easy don't worry oh my god I've just put my first proper zip fly jean zip in place I am feeling that fear that you felt in the pit of your stomachs when you first put a zip in. I can never understand how you feel um, when I just say glib things like, don't worry, it's easy. But now, oh my God, I feel I need to sit down. I've done it. I was allowed to use an unpicker. And I feel great that I've done it and I know that I'll be able to do it again. But, oh, that feeling, it's horrible, isn't it? So I'm sorry, I'm sorry guys and girls that I have talked to put zips in. Um, I now know how you feel. So what are we doing? We're doing the ritual unpicking from the here. front, yes. Is it not easier to go from there Well, you can there? go from the top if you like. I think I might find that easier. Okay, are we ready? I'm gonna reveal. <laughs> I've screwed the whole thing up. <laughs> I did think about the words I used there. I'm gonna put a warning on this video, I've decided. Yeah, it's got too many crotches Profanities. <laughs> crotches, butts and orifices. <laughs> Oh my god! Oh, look, 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 look. Ah, it's amazing! Someone's gonna complain. The volume levels in this are really annoying. We're <laughs> up and down and everyone's shouting. Yeah, but if you put a warning on, there's loads more people will watch it. So. Yeah. <laughs> Contains profanities 18 plus. Excellent. Just to hear, yeah? To the bar tap? Yes, exactly. Or if you can't quite go that far, then that's also fine. It depends where you back tapped, back, um, back stitched when you were basting. Oh, look at that. Look, it stopped. Right on the bar tack. Oh. God, oh, Claire, come. you're good. Unzip. Hang on, hang on. Let me just reveal. Ta -da! <gasps> Look at that! I know. Is that not the most amazingly beautiful thing you've ever oh. seen in your life? Oh my god. And just check out this top stitching. 
just the outside would Esme have been proud of me? Yeah. Patrick would have been yeah. very proud of you. He would have got out his little ruler and measured it and gone, ooh, yeah. Yeah. Claire. Yay! So another day is over. Again, everybody's gone home. And uh, we're all feeling as high as kites. We've all got our flies in, we've sewn up our crotches, and we've top stitched our bum cracks. <laughs> it's been a really fun day. Um, and yeah, I don't think we're that far off finishing. I'm guessing we're gonna baste up our outside legs put our waistband on and try it all on make sure it all fits properly before finishing it off which is really exciting um i'm just going to step outside now hence the doors open and water the geraniums and i'm just putting this out there if you watched last week's video you'll understand why i'm saying it to camera if you didn't go check out last week's bthq banter mummy i am watering the geraniums Charlotte's found a new position on the floor. She's very comfy. Oh, comfy down comfy there? Actually, I'm just going to stay here forever. Forever. <laughs> I can't get back up. I've got the point in my life now where if I get up out of the chair, I have to go, oof. Otherwise, I can't make the oof get up. noise. Yeah, yeah, you need noise. the oof noise. I feel like that all the time. <laughs> Let's see what everyone's up to. What are you doing, Eileen? I'm just doing my waist. Putting your waistband on. Superb. What are the girlies doing in here? Marie, what are you doing? I am trying to work out the waistband. What the heck I'm oh, about. don't worry. When you've done nothing wrong, I had this as well. So that bit, um, don't forget you've now folded in to make the trousers. So you'll find that last notch should end up sitting on the end yeah, there. Right. I panicked too. Do you like my bum? That's awesome. <laughs> that is gorgeous. Hey, Let's see. You've got so your pockets fun. on? Not yet. But you've yeah. No, I've got no bum pockets oh, now. We're just gorgeous. doing fit. Gorgeous. Oh, what good fit. fit. Can you do it? Flash. Flash bottom. Flush! 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 This is a new button. Yes. You ready to do with being a tiny bit taller? Why don't you go and stand at one of the low tables? What about doing it on the bench there, which is at the normal height? That's not as much fun. Now they're too low. Goodness me. We, if you'd taken them off, we'd have been done by now. I know, but you don't like life easy. That's true. <laughs> no, I'm doing it. You're not having it. You've got like, spikes on the back of this hammer. <laughs> oh my god, if you were a man, that would look so painful right now. <laughs> Was that good for you? Trying to do it up, it might go again. Oh, Eileen's spending. <laughs> no, sorry. Oh, sorry, I'm in your way. Sorry. Give us a twirl. I love it. Go, Susan. <laughs> Strap those legs. Let's see them go. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> and give us a twirl so we can see your derriere. <laughs> oh, oh. Derriere. So when everybody pout. <laughs> oh, no, I'm not sure. <laughs> Duck face. You're the only one that's doing it. Right. Make me laugh and the whole thing will, will wobble like mad. On your marks, get set. And cheese. Cheese. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Do you want to go in the middle? Yeah. 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 Come on, Marie, you can't get away with it. It's easy as that. Right. There's a car in the way. Um, I'm going to do you in... in if we shift this way, look. Here we go. Yeah, keep going. Yes, keep shifting. Shut that into a... Oh! Oh! 
better still, yes. Let him down a little bit. That's it. Wild. Gorgeous. <laughs> You're making me giggle. Here's my arse. It's a bad one on my bum. Arsing about. I like it. Did you see what you did there? Yeah, I did. <laughs> So that's our Ginger Jeans workshop officially over. We have had the best time. It's been so much fun. Last night I put the date for Charlotte's next workshop on our website um, and it is on the 10th, 11th and 12th of January 2020. We have already sold three places. Um, so by the time you see this on Friday morning, I don't know if there will be any places available, but you never know. Uh, you might be lucky, but she has also agreed to come and do a swimsuit class and a trouser fitting class, and they'll be on the website shortly. So keep your ears peeled, eyes peeled. Keep your eyes peeled. <laughs> Three days of sewing. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna say goodbye. I'm not gonna bother filming anything tomorrow. The studio is an absolute mess. Um, obviously, we're gonna be tidying it up. You don't need to see us clean. Um, and I will be back Tuesday, Wednesday with normal service resuming. Ta-ta for now. Good morning, it's Tuesday and I have come in this morning and oh my goodness, thank you mummy. I was in here yesterday with my mum first thing in the morning and then had to go off because I had a dentist appointment so when I left it was still absolutely in turmoil in here but this morning is beautiful. I'm going to just flip you around and show So, aside from my handbag being up here, <laughs> all the tables are clear. All the sewing machines have all been sorted and tidied. The floor's beautifully hoovered. Unit two, just put all everything away. I've got to move the tables, but that's fine. Again, all the floors sorted, and it's all back to normal. Ah. Oh. Good morning, it's Tuesday and I have come in this morning and oh my goodness, thank you mummy. I was in here yesterday with my mum first thing in the morning and then had to go off because I had a dentist appointment so when I left it was still absolutely in turmoil in here but this morning is beautiful. I'm going to just flip you around and show So, aside from my handbag being up here, <laughs> all the tables are clear. All the sewing machines have all been sorted and tidied. The floor's beautifully hoovered. Unit two, just put all everything away. I've got to move the tables, but that's fine. Again, all the floors sorted and it's all back to normal. Ah. Oh. My mum is a godsend. Um, so yeah, all normal. So today is sewing club day, which means people come in to get on with their own projects. I'm gonna be working with Viv on a project, something that she's come up with um, for a really nice bag. And I think I'm actually going to do it as my next project for our sewing club. I decided a couple of weeks ago to have a bit of a shake up with the sewing club, so I'll tell you more about that in next week's BTHQ banter because it's a little bit crazy this week. Um, but it does mean that the secret squirrel element is being taken away, which is nice because I can then share with you what I'm working on. Uh, which I think you'll like. Naomi's coming in again today. I have no idea what she's making today, um, but something amazing, I'm sure. So we'll see how the day takes us. I've 
got so caught up in sewing today that it is you know the end of the day and i haven't actually shown you any really of what's going on you would have seen a tiny snippet of me a minute ago sewing together some fabric and i've been creating the next project in our so beautiful thing sewing club i'm going to give you a rundown of all of those projects um, in a separate video but it is a wash bag or project bag you can do whatever you like with it it's all quilted i don't think you can see that maybe you can but it's all quilted let me show you how it works so it's got a handle that runs all the way around the outside of the body here and when the drawstrings are pulled it allows the handle to loosen its grip on the bag and become little handles there's a zip compartment inside a big compartment um yeah it's a really lovely bag i'm really pleased with it the fabric makes it though to be honest and it's got a little d-ring here this fabric was fabric that I picked up in Hobby Lobby when I was in America. Naomi's busy sewing a bag. She is working with, look at this gorgeous fabric, called Disney's Bad Queens, which is gonna be really, really good. And Viv's already left. <laughs> she came she went um, but she made one of these as well with me um it's actually a design that we kind of came up with a little bit together um so she's made one as well so we can kind of see the construction process and plan all of the instructions and everything else and i'll pop a picture of her bag up here because it was really lovely it had these gorgeous dragons on it so that is the end of tuesday tomorrow is wednesday we have classes tomorrow and then that will be the end of what is probably planning out to be quite a long bthq banter for this week um when i edited together the footage of the weekend i managed to get it down to 11 and a half minutes i think but it was something like like 25 26 minutes before I'd even put the rest of the week on so I best stop rambling see you tomorrow good morning it is Wednesday welcome back to BTHQ banter I've got a quiet day today but the lovely Liz is in she's making a sewing machine mat today and while she's doing that I'm going to be cracking on with another project that was previously secret squirrel but I can reveal it to you today I'll do a bit more of it and then I'll hopefully be able to show you when it's nearly finished so I finished my sewing project. Now this isn't going to be released for quite some time. It's going to be project one in our gold lounge of the sewing club. And as I promised earlier, I will do a separate video on how our sewing club works. Um, so it's not gonna be released for a while, but some of our existing silver members will get to do it fairly soon. And I will be releasing it probably as a separate online course and also a standalone in-person course. But I'm gonna show you, but it does mean I have to to chop off my head so i've made this lovely little crossbody messenger bag um, it's got a little flap so you can fill it all the way up to the top because the zip is along the top edge here so you could fill it all the way up or if you don't fill it all the way up it flaps down over the front it's got a little separate pocket on the front which is zippable it's quite a nice pocket and it was designed so that Elspeth could use it to fit her sketchbook in and her pencils in the front <laughs> but it's a really lovely bag it's going to teach you how to use hardware so we've got these lovely rose gold lobster clasps and d-rings I've also used rivets here um, but you can just sew them if you don't want to use rivets and the strap is fully adjustable she says and also has a slider on it so it's going to teach you how to make one of those as well so you can see it all laid out here on the table i'm really pleased with this one i think it's going to be a super popular class liz has finished her um sewing mat which is going to go in her craft room which is just said is black and white um, you can see we've done lovely yellow top stitching for the quilting i'm going to see if i can zoom into the fabric there you go you can see it says textile swatch design notion sketch stitch buttons ribbon embroidery all sorts of hab dab words so we're just going to put it up set it up for a photo shoot now here we go Ta -da! with all of its bits and pieces in its pockets in position so you can do this class with us in person or online. In person you'll learn how to do binding around the outside. Online you won't, but you will learn how to bind your pockets. So Liz has gone home now. It is 10 to 1. 
I've got the door open, so sorry if you hear the traffic. We are on a really busy road here at Beautiful Things. Although it's a lovely rural setting, the main road runs down the side of our building. Um, so I'm going to have a bit of selfish sewing time. I'm going to stitch up my kilo wrap dress in the lovely fabric that I bought from Arizona. I will see you on the other side. So I've finished my kilo dress. I'm really, really happy with that. Um, I've done scuba bands around the neckline and the armholes. I prefer it with bands, but this really ties in nicely, I think, with the stripes and it's really solid. So this is a really super floaty jersey, so it's quite nice to have this solid structure holding it in place. And as you can see, I've left the pink overlock thread on my machine from making my jeans, so that all ties in really nicely with the flowers. I'm dead chuffed with that. I think I might wear it tomorrow. So that is BTH key banter over for a, another week. Now, I'm going to say this now. There will be no BTH key banter next week. Next week is school May half-term holiday here in the UK. Um, Mr. Mac and I are away for a few days with the kids and we are going to be doing all sorts of bits and pieces so if you want to see what we get up to i would suggest following my instagram which is arty farty mac um, or befriend me on facebook again you can find my details and my profile down below and you can see what we get up to there will be some fabric shopping involved which means there will be some vlogs coming for you but as we have a quiet week here at the studio i think maddie's only teaching a couple of classes um, we're not going to worry about having the pressure of putting a BTH key banter up for you. There will be videos going up on the channel in the meantime though so do keep um, watching make sure you're subscribed and that you've hit that little bell for notifications but BTH key banter will be back in two weeks time. Thank you very much for watching I know it's been a long one this week take care bye